what is happening guys we are back in our world of Aetherius just so you know that's the old one so last one we checked out a couple of areas that look pretty good but we have a lot more to go through here so without further ado let's just get into it and dive into our next building which I believe is gonna be this big sucker we got a nice little tunnel going through and everything come on. Oh. Whoa, I, uh, I don't like this. This looks really, really bad. Oh, I didn't even notice that. We have a little gate there. Um, overall tunnel design, F. I hate it. It looks bad. Wait, oh, a sphere. I wonder if we have anything hidden inside. Oh, what a shame this is. All right, so we're just going to run around on foot, check everything out, and then afterwards we'll do flybys and things. Get a top view. I think that'll work good. That's a good format. Gooder. That'll work much gooder. So, anyway. Very, very plain. But it works? I don't know. It's too big for the amount of plainness. What do we got inside? Amazing. Amazing skill. <laughs> this interior work. I don't know how anyone's gonna match it. I need to put glowstone everywhere just to see in here. But I did start with I did start with something. And I oh ho ho I actually covered a glowstone. This is probably my first time ever. Amazing. What do we have in these? Nothing. What do I have in my inventory? A couple of arrows, iron ore, cobblestone, cobblestone, redstone, glowstone. And a chunk of bedrock. Perfect. Anything in you? No. Well, what was the point? Well, we'll just go ahead and close you up. Well, this was amazing. This was a, this was a great. Man, there's another train. This is ridiculous. This is amazing. Amazing skills. Truly something to appreciate. Appreciate a big trap in the, in the floor. That's good. All right. Moving on. Let us. What is this mess of cobblestone? What is this? Conglomeration of things. We'll check out some houses next. Let me up here. What, what is this? I need to check this out first. No entry, apparently. What is this? Let me in. Oh, it's a cover for a hole in the ground. Nice. Anything down here? <laughs> There's Cal. He's been lost down here for years. And it just comes to the end. Well, buddy. I hope you enjoy your time. Good luck getting out of here. It's your own fault for wandering down. You deserve this. You deserve it, Mr. Cal. Okay, so that was fruitless. So, oh, I never even pay attention to the road. What do we got going on on the road here? What is this, Lapis Lazuli? Lapis Lazuli? So. I think this house looks good, shape-wise. Not, de not detail-wise. Why did I stop? We have... I'm gonna count this as an interior because we have that thing with the light in it. That thing with the light in it. The worst chandeliers you've ever seen in your life. And we have a stairway up to the top. Oh, this is. Oh, this is beautiful. That, that's not. In big buildings like the castles and the cathedrals and things, I'll leave holes up. Instead of windowing everything, I'll leave some holes in sometimes. Because on a big building, it's not so bad. But a house? Oh, come on. Come on. You don't want no holes in your house. Getting rain in there. More bugs than usual. I mean, it's just not a good situation. You don't want to be in that. You ain't going to leave that open. What was I thinking? All right. Overall, I'll give this building... I will give this building a B. On a scale of F to S with some other letters if I feel something is really bad. 
moving on we got another house so what do we got going on in this one ladders to the top what is this let's go ahead and look we got a door outside a little tiny balcony that one's got a balcony too hmm overall can't say it bedroom hey this one actually has a marked off bedroom did I miss something in this other one let me go back Overall, I give this one, I give this road design an absolute, I, I don't even know. What's a worse letter than F? Anything. This road design, I hate. This is terrible. This building deserves a solid C, I think. Nothing too spectacular. Nothing too great, but it's a good manor type house design, I suppose. But we'll go with a C. I wouldn't recommend it. Alright. This one, this one has a chance to redeem itself. Do you have doors out to your balcony? You have holes in your roof. You lost points there. And you can't get out to your balcony. You stay. You stay as a bee. Shape of you, the shape of you is good. Everything else is not. But you have a stairway. Which is better than a ladder. I'll give you that. Alright. Moving on. I'm gonna guess this one is a home of a blacksmith. That's gotta be a forge. I'm hoping that's a forge. It better not be anything dumb. So coming in here, he's got a nice little walkway in his house. Okay. You don't have a whole lot, but you do have a stairway. You got little sills in your windows. Okay, all right. So so far, so good. What do we got upstairs? Oh. All right, all right, I'm liking it. You got a nice little patio out here to come out. Just look at the lake, look at this eyesore. Okay, all right. That, that stone, that just cold stone. That house, hey, you know, I kind of like the roof of that house, actually, it looks pretty good. Hmm, I'll give you a C plus now. All right, you get, you get a C plus. So he's got some nice views from this house, alright. So far, I'm liking this one. I think this might be the strongest contender yet. <laughs> oh. I even put some fencing out here. He's got a little, little diving spot. Okay, alright, alright. I'm liking it. Nice little cover over this. Oh, this, yep, this is a smith for sure. He's got some lava in there. What do you got in your chest? Why does that just open up? Where's that crafting table? <laughs> I don't know what that is. He's got three anvils. This guy has got some money. He's got some cauldrons. This is a chest. Those things must be crafting tables. Oh, he's got some stuff in here. More than he should have. Why is this even over there? Emeralds? That can't be. I must have played this world more... I don't know. I guess I don't remember what emeralds were added in, but... Huh. Interesting. Got some forages. Alright. Overall, I'm going to go ahead and give this house a B+. I think it's the best one yet. If I said A on anything, I take it back, because I don't think anything we've been in so far deserves it. Aside from the castle. The first castle we looked at in the last episode. I like that castle a lot. That deserves an A. Nothing else deserves an A yet. Alright, so what do we got here? Oh, we have a water mill. Okay, alright. Nothing too spectacular, but it's a water mill, so let's go ahead and take a look at the backside, shall we? It seems bigger on the outside than the inside. I like that. I like that design. Not the bottom, but the top. That's pretty good. I like that. Alright, what about the watermill itself? Ugh, gross. Hmm. Hmm. 
you know, overall, I like it. I think it looks good. I think the house is simple, but it, it you know, it's fitting. There's just a guy in there maintaining it, watching. You know, it's all working correctly. It's big. So I'm going to go ahead and give that one. I'll give you a B minus. You deserve that. Alright, so what do we have here? This must be a farm or something. I mean, we've got plants out here, so. What are we looking at on the inside? What are, what are we working with in here? Mm -hmm. I like the brew for this. On the inside. Nice little pillar in the center for some light. Still too much glowstone showing, but I can forgive that. You need light, you know. You need it, so. No matter what it looks like. You got too many. <laughs> you got too many pumpkins. I don't even know what these other crops are. I never play survival, so I don't even know what half of these things are. This must be wheat. You are a farmer. I like that roof a lot. Let's go ahead and get another view. Hmm. Mm. I'm gonna give that a B plus. That deserves it. This is good. I like this. Jeez, I don't know what that sound is outside. It's loud. It must be a snowboard. Alright, so yeah. Yeah, let's look at a B plus. Mostly because that roof. Man, that roof is nice. Alright, so let's go ahead and go out. Uh, we'll skip that for now. We'll go look at this castle area. What do we have going on in here? This is a pretty long run. Nothing compared to what Bluestone is good to shape it up to be, but hey. I mean, just a little update on that, too. I've been burning away trees kind of here and there. I've been getting rid of a lot of trees, clearing out space for residential areas and business areas and things. So, I started doing some windows, I see. They look pretty textured and a little, I don't know, a little messy looking. This part, though, what do we got? We got a patch of grass there. We just gave up on the floor for that spot. We're like, yeah, I don't know. Hmm. Hmm. You know what? I like this, but it certainly needs more work. But it's a good base to start with, actually. It looks pretty good. I like, th I like these clump of stairs out here. It looks pretty good. Clumps of stairs can look really good. Alright, so we got a little walkway. Yeah, I don't know why we gave up on that, but we did. Mmm. Man, it's lost door. Alright, there's a big building. The sphere. Man, I like the sphere. We got a little bridge going across the water. Must be diamonds and emerald. And iron? I'm going to say iron. Okay. Well, the bridge comes over these. Nope, no flying. No flying yet. We'll, come, we'll, take, we'll do a flyby every time later. What are these? Candles? Torches? Not really sure what those are. I want to break into that sphere, too. I want to see if there's anything in there. But for now, we didn't even put a road over to the entrance to the castle. Just grass. I'm assuming there's nothing in here then. There's holes in the bottom. This can't be good. Oh, oh. Yeah. Yep, this got left. I was like, you know what? I'm sick of breaking blocks. I'm sick of it. I give up. <laughs> pretty, pretty large building though. You can do some you can do some stuff with this. Obviously not going to, but you could have done, I and mean, I didn't, but, you know, overall, alright, I will give this, I can't really give a cast of these, like, because it's too big to see from the ground, from anywhere, I think, because I think the walls, the walls are so huge that you can't even see the castle, so, I don't know what to give that yet. The walls are massive, though. I'll, I'll give the walls a, a, a B. Not even. They get a C because they're so ugly looking and so big. 
big walls are fitting in certain areas, but not this, I don't think. I don't know. I don't know what I have to think of those. All right, so now the next area here, I'm gonna count that as separate because that's I'm pretty sure a finished area. So we're gonna go ahead. We're gonna go ahead and do a little flyby of the areas here. This base village. Hmm. Man, this is beautiful. This is beautiful and huge. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna give this. Man, I'm gonna give this an S. This is really good. This well, amazing design. Amazing. All right. Anyway, we we know vanilla. Old vanilla stuff especially looks really terrible, so we'll just give that a pass. Alright, so this little cluster of houses here. Oh, I was going through a sort of a interconnected thing here. Not terrible. Alright, so overall, I'm gonna give I'm just gonna count all these cluster of homes as just one. I will give these I'll give these a C plus. They're okay. They're not very good, but they're okay. They're very good. So we'll move on. Library. Library, library. I think you look hideous from the outside. Really bad. The rooftop, not terrible. It's alright. It'll do. A lot of stairs. Did it with stairs? I can't remember if I graded you, so I'm not going to do it again. I don't want to contradict myself. This thing is ugly as all sin. I, I don't like this. Design-wise, I think it looks good. Not design. Shape-wise. Shape-wise, I think it looks good. Design-wise, I think it looks terrible. For the most part. There's a couple things in here that you could salvage and use. This, this These little chunk here, it's not bad. It looks alright. You know, you can make that usable. This chunk here, maybe. I don't know. It's a little too messy. I'd probably get rid of these and I'd probably replace these with something. I don't know. It's, it's really... It's really bottled. I don't know. This building's just bad. It's just bad. I don't like it. Alright, so now we'll move on to this building. As this one is the one we did next. The roof design, I love it. I really, really love it. It looks good. This looks really good, I think. Aside from that hole in the roof. Which is probably... Let's see if I got it the same on both sides. I did. Hey, and I put a log there, so alright. Saved. I don't remember what I gave this building, but I'll give this roof an A+. I like that roof. I'll give that roof an A+. I'll give this roof a good rating, too, if it didn't have these holes. I should have done something different with that. Hmm. Hmm. Overall, he's still good, though. Typical A-frame with a little added jazz in there. This section I like a lot, so I'm gonna go ahead. I'll give the roof itself minus points for the holes, but I'll give you I'll give you a B plus. All right, moving on to this one. Yeah, this roof I actually like. It's pretty good. It's very flat, but that's fine. You know, sometimes that that's good. Sometimes it can work out really well. I forgot about this building, we'll cover that, we'll cover that next, it's so huge, we need to fly around and look at it and um, Alright, so yeah, that's pretty good, I'll give that roof a B. This one. Oh man, no, I gave this house like an A, or a B plus, a B plus, or an A, I don't remember. <laughs> I don't remember at all. Man, let's get the rating. It looks pretty good, but it's got some bad things going for it. Alright, so the water mill. Looks pretty good. I like it. Nothing too fancy, but, you know, respectable. I like this. No! No! I like this roof a lot, but I don't like the holes in the roof. I do like it. I think it needs to be a little. No, it fits because you know, the backside is sloped enough to it. I don't know. It's just it's really interesting looking to me, and I like it. Oh man, yeah, it's got wood. Which is not supposed to. Okay. I just failed it. 
Alright, so I like it. I'm not grading some of these things because I don't remember what I gave it initially and I don't want to contradict myself like I already said. So let's go ahead and fly up. Oh, we actually have a bridge up here. I didn't see that. Okay. Got a little bridge. I'm not walking off that way. I don't want to spoil. Ooh. Okay. So let's get a closer look at this. Oh, I covered, I covered the glowstone. All right. So overall design we had going for this is going to just be this pattern all the way up. I assume. No, it couldn't have been. Because this patch right here is not the same as this middle patch. So I was gonna go with something else. Oh yeah, obviously there's a window up here. Hmm. Overall design of this window piece is I don't know, I'm not a huge fan. A little too clunky looking. They don't really fit the style of this. This would fit more in like a dwarven type building than I would do probably. I'm gonna have to give you a, a failure. That's, that's no good, I don't like it. Oh, we got a chicken. Here, here buddy, I'll help you out. Yeah, get out of here. Or stay, that's fine too. What is this? An egg, he laid an egg. Thank you, but I'll leave it. I'll let that hatch all on its own. Squares. Phew. <laughs> squares. I barely ever do squares. Alright, so overall, yeah. Not bad, not bad. Let's go ahead and get up here. Desert, gross. Oh, why is everything I build next to a desert? It seems like, man, I don't like it. So that castle design, not a huge fan of. Not a whole lot of sense to it. It's just kind of let's do it this way. Now let's go this way, and then let's go back this way. The wall is massive. It's super long. It's very tall. Obviously, it took a long time to do. Um, alright, so let's get another look at this. No roof either, come on. What? Hmm. You know, I kind of like the wall. I could do something like that again, but I would definitely make it a little shorter, probably a little shorter and much better looking. As for the castle itself, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna give that a D minus. I don't like it. It's just, no. It's not doing it for me. Alright, so let's go ahead now. Let's break into this. Let's break into this baby. A glowstone. <laughs> let me let me in. Hmm. <laughs> well, there's nothing in here. Well, there's something. What was going on in there? There was obviously something, but a spectacular failure. A miserable failure, I would even go so far as to say. Alright, so let's go ahead and check out this Coliseum. Shall we? Because I know exactly. Wait, 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 wait. Nope. No flying yet. We never walked into this. I forgot. I forgot to walk into this one. I forgot it was even there. Alright, so let's go ahead. This looks like an entrance, too. So let's go ahead and take. Oh, stairs. That's a good sign, right? Not, you don't even you don't even put stairs on the outside walkway yet. That's a good sign for finish. Oh, wait. I do have an interior. The exterior is very not good. Whoa. This is all. <laughs> this is not finished. Not at all. I mean, we have some stuff finished. What is all this? Seating? I mean, 
I would, I'm definitely going to be doing another Colosseum sort of build. And probably in the Kingdom of Bluestone. So this will be good to get some ideas for what I did however long ago this was. Oh, I got seating everywhere. These must be walkways. Oh, yeah. So you come out. And you're like, oh, I need to get up to the high rows. I'm too poor to get the low rows. I gotta go up higher and higher. Although, it may be to your advantage. In Minecraft, the higher you go, the better you can probably see. So let's go ahead and check it out. We gotta check out the lower seats first. What is that? That's a super spectator box. It's got glass in the bottom. You can just stand there and look. See, if you had these seats right here, <coughs> if they're fighting on that side, you're golden. You're good. You can see it pretty well. If they're fighting on this side, you can't see it at all. Oh, and the, content the audience can just fall right in. What is this stone? What is that stone? Ugh. I hate it. It's very, very ugly. <gasps> Holes. That's, that's not good at all. So if you were sitting up here, let's see. Mm, you don't have a very great view at all. Oh, we can't even access the spectator spot yet. Okay. You got a bridge up there too? Alright, so let's go ahead and let's head up. <coughs> Excuse me. I mean, overall, oh, oh, whatever that block is, it looks, is it stone bricks? Why would they be colored that? Oh, the upper stands. Oh, that roof. Oh, I love it. All right. What is this supposed to be? Oh, these. Are, this is the walkway up to the upper levels. Okay. Well, first let's. <coughs> oh, excuse me. So you can just stand here and look down. Your view is. No, oh, no. We're gonna cheat. So your view from here is pretty terrible, pretty pretty awful. You know this one actually has stairs. Let's go ahead and get up here. Overall, I do like this design a lot actually. This coliseum, and I want to do something like this. Although this is awful, I was completely wrong. The higher you up are, the <laughs> the much worse off you are. You're not gonna see much of anything. So if we're gonna do something like this, I need to definitely. I need to go to the spots in the building, look down, make sure you can see a good portion of the fight area. Because this is not good design. Like, it may look cool. I think it looks really good. But it is so, so bad and non-functional that it's just not good. It brings it down a bit. But I really want to look at a fly up and look at that roof. So, Alright, so what did you see from here? How about this go? Oh, yeah, they got seats in here. So you can... Yeah, alright. This, this is the spot. If you're gonna come see fights in this building, this is where you want to be. This is it. The light glass is not really that great. It's got the gold... Got the gold lining on it. Um, so we do have some of these decorated. Let's go ahead and take a look. Oh, yes. Right next to the place. Pretty simple. simple, but it'll do the job. It'll do the trick. Not anything great. I'm do some more. But this rooftop. I'm definitely going to be copying something like this for the one that we built now, because I think this looks fantastic. What do we got here? What are we using? Slabs. Slabs only. Alright, I like it. It's very simple, you know, it's very linear. But it looks really good. The only shame is that you can't see this from the ground at all. You also have to just build like a random tower over here. Oh yeah, it's a guard tower. Really, it's just there to see the rooftop. Because a lot of times you put a lot of roof, a lot of work, a lot of work into the rooftops, and nobody, you never get to see them. Nobody gets to look at them really. So you gotta find some reason. So 
That's a little trick I'll probably be using in Bluestone. Some of the rooftops there that I'm going to lake a lot. I already know it. But you won't be able to see them very well, so I'm just going to build a random tower. This, this is a guard tower, yeah. Yeah, obviously, you're going to want guards here. Yeah. I mean, why wouldn't you? Why, why, why wouldn't you want somebody up here guarding, you know, looking over there, making sure nobody's coming, right? But it's just there. Oh, man. Oh, man. It looks so good. I love it. I love it. All right. Well, so that covers everything in this area. That mining shaft, I give that a super F. This random bed right outside of it, oh my gosh. Wait, no, this is not the same one. This just goes to, from there to there. I still gave it a terrible grade. This though, this this deserves a super F. This deserves, yeah, the worst. The worst of the worst. There's a random bed outside too. Oh my gosh. I'm not... <laughs> I like that lever design though. I want to use some things like that. I already have planned. So, we have one other area to check out in this quote, city that, uh, I'm going to go ahead and save for the next one because it's a big area and it's one I really like. I still have, every time I every time I think about building a building, I think back to this one. Because this was my first huge, you know, mega building that turned out, it turned out so good. So every time when I'm building one now, I always think back to this one. I'm like, man, I really want to rebuild this building. I really do. But it would take a lot of time because I'd have to write down, well, it's one block here, one here, and then go this way. And then the rooftop would be difficult to do as well. But it may be something I tried anyway because even though by building standards I have now, it might not be amazing. But I love it. I like it so, so much. Mostly probably because it was my first completed, fully done mega build thing. So, you know anyway I'm gonna go ahead and cut this one off here and we have quite a bit more of the world to cover this is actually taking longer than I thought so it's actually gonna be kind of a little mini series which is always great not what I expected but I'll take it and enjoy it so with that there I'll see you guys in the next one to check out more of the world of Aetherius see you guys <laughs>